Is he behind her? Please be behind her. Please be behind her. Please be behind her. Please. Yes, this is their song. Hello, people, and welcome. If it's your first time, my name is Tali Adioli, and this is This My Dem. Today, I'm going to be doing reacting to the final episode of My Demon. But before that, let's do a recap of episode 15. You know, I had a general recap of the entire series so far. Like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and let's just get into it. So, I love My Demon. I was one of the people like, when I first saw it, I was pushing it everywhere. I was talking about it everywhere. And then at episode 10, I think, it started, they started losing me. It was just too much. It was one heartache after the other. Like, they just couldn't win. So, I just was pissed off that they would overcome one hurdle, another one would come up. They will overcome that, something else will come up. Like, it was just always something. And the final one, I was like, okay, they got over this, you know. Um... It is what it is. He thought he was responsible for her death. He, She said no matter what, they should be together. Then they now brought the whole dad and the deal thing. And I was like, how in God's name are they supposed to get over this? How? 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 How is she supposed to ever look at him and not see that he was indirectly the cause of her dad's death? I'm not blaming him. The dad signed the deal on his own accord. But I'm saying if he wasn't there to give the deal in the first place, who knows, right? So how, you know? And then in this last episode, we see that Walsim's backstory. So Walsim is, you know, her previous self that fell in love with Guwan's previous self back way back when. And we see that he actually saved her because she was going to kill herself. So I'm like, okay, okay, you know what? Fine, they brought it back, redeeming quality. Then... Uh, what's his name? Sumin? Is he Sumin? No, Sukmin, I think. The son, Madame Ju's son. I'm watching Marry My Husband and I feel like she's Sumin. I think he's Sukmin. Yes, if it's wrong, I'll put his name when I'm editing. Comes back out of nowhere, blames Dodo He for everything, kidnaps her, you know, tortures her so that Guon will come. When Guon comes out, um, they manage to thwart him. He picks up a gun. I don't know why they don't just, keep, you know what? It's fine. Picks up a gun, shoots at them. Dodo, he takes the bullet. And apparently she dies on impact. Because, yet again, another hurdle. Go on, brings her back. Which is one of the no-nos for a demon. You cannot kill somebody. You can't bring somebody back from the dead. And I think something about hurting human beings or something like that. I don't know. Influencing or something. I don't know. There are rules. I don't remember. But that was a no-no. So, obviously, when she comes back, she's like, what did you do? He's like, I saved myself. He combusts. And I'm just sitting here like, well, so what do they want us to do? We're just supposed to sit here and take it. Take the abuse that they are giving because it is abuse. I'm just fed up. All I want is for these people to be together. And they just don't want to do it. So you know what I'm doing? After this, after I marry my husband and after um, Transit Love Exchange Season 3, I'm switching. I'm watching Death's Game because I need a break from the romance part of K-dramas. I need some thriller, I need some excitement, and I need um, some gore. I don't like horror, and I know Koreans do horror well. I'm not doing horror, but I will do thriller, and I will do gore and action. So that's what I'm going to do because my demon has taken me for a spin, and I'm not having fun with it. I am excited to watch this last episode, though, so let's get into it because that's what we came here for. <laughs> I will watch it. I haven't watched the intro since episode one, so I will watch it in honor of the last episode. I'm actually excited. I'm not gonna lie, cause I I know they end up together. I just want to see how it comes to play. Oh, they changed it from the first episode, didn't they? I never watched the intros before. I don't even know what Sukmin was hoping to achieve. It's not like he can get his wealth and his power back. Right? So, I mean, I guess people don't really think about these things. It's not about logic. It's about revenge. You know what he said too here? He said, I'm going to wait for him to say it. So you guys hear, I can do all things through him. That strengthens me, which is a Bible verse, obviously. But they made God a woman here. So why do you have to say him? Hmm? I'm like, pick a lane, you know? It's called a woman or 
Is God not a woman? It's so messed up. It's so sad. It's like they can't catch a break. No matter what they are doing, something is taking them away from each other. It's like they just want to love each other. Come on. Mary's a lingua. How many times does she have to lose her husband, huh? Who writes these things? <laughs> Episode 15. She'd come home drunk. He would, you know, change her, put her to bed. He watched out after her, actually. Just kind of cool. But also sad. That's so messed up. Like, they just can't catch a break. All they want is God crying. Oh, you do know you have the power to change it, right? I mean, don't tell me his name was on there. Oh, I'll, they're all gonna stop. Yeah, I'll bring. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I can't, I can't cry. I need to save my tears for exchange, people, because I know it's coming. Hope she doesn't kill herself. He did. He was in hell. The hell I was in hell. Did you? Did you? I feel for him though. Like, what what happened? Like, what made him this way? I really do feel for him. She's so pretty. And there's that finality to like towards it, knowing that he's not hanging around. He's not coming back. See, this is why I was scared of that. She'll try and kill herself. You shouldn't leave her alone. Nobody, she should not be left alone right now. At all. Can it 200 years from now and it'll happen all over again? I can't, I can't do it. Mm -mm. I can't Can't Because she's not eating. They just can't win, can they? Like, they just won't let them have it. That's pissing me <laughs> off. God has got to do something. I mean, what is she here for? Right?
If they start playing their song, I know he's there. Is he behind her? Please be behind her. Please be behind her. Please be behind her. Please. Yes, this is their song. Is he human or is he still a demon? Oh my god. You can't even understand the relief. I knew they would get back together, but I just didn't see. Okay. I can watch this episode now. <laughs> He's still a demon! Okay, okay. Oh, he looks like he's been in hell. <laughs> At the end. This is nice. Because we've been without them for a few episodes now and I miss them. <laughs> oh. His sweater being up is bugging the life out of me. <laughs> Oh, they fixed it. Thank God. <laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> it's driving me nuts. Put it down. <laughs> it had to be said, no? Put that sweater neck down. I wish Paul. It has to be. They have to clear the air, honestly. <laughs> Oh no! She was losing the baby. He literally signed the deal that brought Gowon's wife into the world. Blown. He really does find desperate people. Why does he only give 10 years though? I still don't understand it. It's twice. <laughs> oh, they got customers. Aww. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Okay, they're my new favorite gang. Of course. They actually missed each other. What? You said the Kaban She's, you can't be chairwoman, right? you're terrible. <laughs> oh, she was hoping for her sons, I see. What fresh hell is she about to bring that? I love the outfit though, like, it is giving. <laughs> <laughs> At least she has her voice. Honestly, her brother's family was like, decimated. should be fun if she wasn't so crazy all the time it just clicked now why he burned half of his face because burning half of his face makes his face unrecognizable that's why go on couldn't find him ah no they didn't 
넌 아무도 파괴하지 못했어. 음. 정구원은 다시 돌아왔고 난 보다시피 멀쩡하거든. I love it. 아, sure that's the snap. Ah, uh, he snapped. Did go on pay him a visit and oh, oh, who is this now? <gasps> Mama Bear came to see him. Oh, he snapped. He snapped. Oh, the picture with all of them. She's gonna break down and start crying now. Some chum was. Oh, Mark. Tell me, Sunda. He was a normal child, and then that guy just screwed him up for no goddamn reason. So sad. Her baby boy. No. She's just the last girl that fell in love and couldn't let that go. I feel so bad for her past, but I'm I'm glad for her future. Oh, she went back to the house she grew up in. <laughs> yes. Yes. Go, stop. You have the chance to do something that somebody else did for you. Save her. Save her. I can't speak. Oh my goodness. I didn't think Jin Star would be the one to get me before. Woof. at that time she was moving mad oh jean star i'm so happy i didn't actually want her to leave honestly i did not He's <laughs> in so much trouble. know why they want cutest couple but ji hyuk and ji won are coming silly humans hey her good is good now why would you be a homeless person if you can be anybody in the world i'll get it but god walks in mysterious ways i guess So cute. Oh, I love it. 
is all I've been wanting. All I've been wanting. I didn't ask for too much, did I? I knew that they would end up together but like did they have to jerk us around like that I feel like this is the worst one I've experienced I know you guys who watch k-dramas probably this is nothing compared to what you've witnessed here's the thing I don't want to witness any of it <laughs> this was a lot for me because it was like how how are they supposed to get over the next thing and the next thing and the next thing then her father died by tech indirectly his hand like where where do you even come back from that from you know so that was what was bugging me but i knew they would end up together in the end obviously and i really enjoyed it would i still recommend this 100 percent. it does end on a very good note the actors are fantastic there's a lot of storyline there there's lessons to be learned you know people actually learn their lessons and try to help in the end give back to the community or society or whatever it is that they were giving back to so that was kind of nice but all in all it's a romance story people and if you're in the mood for love watch it <laughs> because you will laugh cry and feel everything that they're feeling but it was absolutely fantastic and I did like it. it. It made up for the entire heartache that we'd gone through since episode 10. So yeah, that's a wrap for my demon people. Just like that, we're done with this one. Um, I am covering Mary, my, my husband right now. And that one is hella good. It's getting even more spicy now. Like I said, um, Gwon and Dodo, he won best couple. But for me, Jiwon and Jihook will take it any day, anytime. Like... I don't even, I can't even express how much I am invested in that couple, which might bite me in the ass later on because of course they're going to check us around as they did with this one, but hopefully it's not this bad. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the entire thing. I will do, um, I will put everything into one video. It will be reactions and reviews mixed together just from episode one to episode 16. So that if anybody's interested, they can find that there. But yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.